On this trip, I brought the Air Force Texan back home on a hog hunt. I started off on the range checking zero using the Nielsen 308 Spitzer. My rifle had been modded and tuned by Air Guns of Texas. The barrel cut down, recrowned, and a custom suppressor installed. Then power set up to yield the best accuracy with these bullets. Pigs are a non-indigenous pest species in Texas, and even with a lot of hunting pressure, their population and their range continues to expand. The mid and big bore air guns prove to be an effective and efficient pig killer with the right shot selection and placement. When using an arrow gun or a very powerful big bore, I'll take a heart lung shot. However, my preference is for a headshot. I find that the pellet or bullet dropped down the ear or close to it will anchor most pigs on the spot. I'll also place a shot between the eyes when that's the best option. But you want to make sure the snout is pointing down. If the head is up, the bullet may slide along the skull and over the top of the head. As an example, I'll show you a few of the headshots on smaller pigs with smaller bore. That's 35 caliber and below rifles. I really think it's all about shot placement. To start off with, I got a ride across the ranch. finishing the last couple hundred yards to the blind by foot. I scan the bush looking for pigs along the way. Lots of sign to be found. But I didn't see any pigs on the move. I'd stop off into glass under trees and look for pigs bedded down. Eventually I got to the blind and settled in. It was early afternoon and I planned to stay until sunset. After about a half hour, a few small pigs came in. There was one decent dry sow in the group. They fed along on the corn I'd thrown in the road. When she stepped out, I lined up the shot and let it fly. The bullet impacted and the pig dropped with hardly a twitch. After waiting a few minutes to see if any more pigs came in, I dragged her back and settled back in. It was about 5 and the feeder was set for 6 o'clock. It was close to sunset and a few small hogs came in. I reckon this was my last chance, so I took the shot. Another headshot, my Texan 308, 
did the job again. I really enjoyed shooting this rifle. I'll have more coming using my 308, 357, and 457 Air Force rifles and carbines. If you like this video and would like to see more, let me know. Please give me a like and subscribe if you haven't already.